Good morning everyone, today we'll have the HIIT Tabata workout. Let's do quick warm up first. And first move is arm circles. Very important to warm up your shoulder joints before any exercise. Increase your circus range and also move arms in different directions. And next exercise is side to side twist. Two twists we're doing just with arms, on the third twist we added a knee. Very good for shoulders, for spine and of course for hips. Few more times guys, increasing our range and next exercise will be a little bit uh, more energetic, so it's jump twist. Twist your core so we keep arms in one direction and uh, our toes in other direction. And doing small gentle jumps. And few more times and next exercise, the last in our warm up, it shuffles. Place your feet forward and back, also changing core direction. And shuffle your feet as quick as possible. And few more seconds left. Three, two, one. Well done, guys. And now we're going into the main part of our workout. Tabata is a timer where you 20 seconds extremely work and 10 seconds rest. 12 exercises. Let's go. And first move for this 20 seconds will be ice scatter. Let's pretend we are skiing now and try to jump side to side as much range as you can and twist your core. Also, the faster you're going, the more calories you burn. So we have 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 second left. Now we have 10 seconds break. For the next exercise, it's better to have a mat. So move starts in 3 seconds and uh, it's called inchworm and mountain climber. So let's go. So we're doing small steps with our arms uh, until plank position and then we're doing mountain climber and return back and repeating this exercise inch warm plus 10 mountain climbers. Three seconds left, two, one, good job. Rest 10 seconds and next move uh, consume a lot of energy. So it's full body move calls burpee. Let's go, jump and then plank and then push up and then again jump and clap. Good thing that during the burpees, every tiny muscle in your body always working. Halfway guys, already five seconds left. One more burpees. Let's go, let's go. Three, two, one. Well done. 10 seconds rest. Breathe in through your nose, breathe out through your mouth. And next move, one of my favorites, called squat pulses. Let's go. Squat position and we don't go in, uh, on the way up. So we're staying in the squat position and doing small uh, range pulses. 10 seconds left, halfway. 8 seconds, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Well done, guys. Good thing, guys, we're halfway on our workout. 5 seconds resting, 4, 3, 2, 1, and next move is side lunge, knee rise. Let's go guys! Working knee is bent and other knee is straight and also pull your core a little bit forward. In this move you're supposed to feel glutes a lot. When you're going up, push through your heel. 4 seconds left, 3, 2, 1, well done guys! Now the same thing we will do on other leg. Move on another side of the mat and let's do it. Two, one, let's go. Bend your core forward, squeeze your stomach and push through your heels. Side lunges very good for hips, glutes and also for adductor group. All right, six seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done, guys. Next move will be a little bit dynamic, so it's good for uh, burn energy as much as you can. So let's start. Jump in long distance. So try to do as long jump as you can and then step back and start from the beginning. 10 seconds more. Let's go. Make sure what you're doing everything right, what you're using your muscles. Don't be like relaxed and rested because uh, with jump need to be alert for not cause injuries. 
So we have 10 seconds rest and next exercise will be actually run, side to side run and touch the ground. Let's go! As quick as you can, burn your calories and you, if you have more uh, larger distance to run you can use your distance uh, or if you don't have uh, you can do same as me. We have 5 seconds more, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good thing, our workout is slowly going to the end, but we still have several exercises to go through. So, and next exercise will be frog squat. So, place your elbows uh, between your knees and when you actually extend your hamstrings, so try to keep your elbows there. And uh, then when you're sitting, just uh, try to uh, expand your knees with your elbows. So very good exercise. Well done, guys. And good scene was the rest of our workout will be on a mat. So place yourself on a mat, lie down and let's go. Bicycle kicks. So move your abs as fast as you can. We have 10 seconds to go. Uh, squeeze your abs. Make sure what lower back uh, stay on a mat. You don't have a gap between uh, your lower back and a mat. All right, that was very quick. For the next move, also lie down on a mat, and now we will do uh, also core workout called heel touch. So try to touch your heel from side to side if you want to do progression. So keep your feet together because it will be more difficult to reach the heel. And try to reach the heel, activate your abs. Three seconds left, two, one. Well done, guys. Less than one minute left, so next uh, exercise will be in three seconds. So again, lie on your back, uh, put your arms under your glutes and let's do bike spin. 15 seconds left, uh, keep your low back uh, on, on a map, uh, make sure it's attached and five seconds left. So keep going, four, three, two, one. Well done! That was the last exercise for this workout. Good job, guys! Uh, if you like this workout, uh, put like and comment. And see you on my next videos. Bye-bye!